congratulations. Your first MIAA championship, first year head coaching. Can you even put into words for me what this feels like? You know, it's kind of surreal at the moment. Um, I, I obviously am proud of my players and, and what, what we've accomplished, but I give credit to Calvin. They, they, they really fought back. Um, but all season long, these, these guys haven't quit believing. And I think that's been the great trait for our, of our team. It's been, a, been characteristic of everything that we've done. They've had confidence all the way through and, and, uh, and then keep, kept binding together as a team. So it, it, all the credit goes to the guys. You know, I knew what to expect. We played these guys so many times in my career. I knew exactly what we needed to do, and the seniors stepped up huge tonight, and it was a team effort 100%. How special was it to get this done for Coach Neal in his first year? Man, feels that's got to feel so good for Coach Neal. Um, you know, Coach Van Weeren carried us for so long, and Coach Neal um, studied and learned under him, and now it's his time, and uh, he's going to be—he's going to have a tremendous career. He's got a lot more of these coming. On top of being an MIAA championship game, it was a Hope Calvin game. Does that add a little something special? You know, I mean, the Hope Calvin rivalry is going to be great no matter where it is, what it is about. I mean, whether it's in the the uh, Select Bank tournament or if it's going to be here, but um, you know, I, we're used to playing each other in this championship game. I mean, this has been the sixth year in a row, I think, that it's gone on, and and uh, we've been fortunate to win it a lot of those years. So. Um, it's special to have the rivalry, but yet it's more, I mean, it means more to us to win that championship. When Calvin kind of came back there at the end, you had your shorter lineup in. What was your game plan with that? Well, we were going to keep, keep switching all screens. We were going to defend, get up on the three more. And then offensively, we, we thought we would have better movement with our smalls and having their guys chase us. And we did. I mean, we got some back cuts, we got some easy layups, we got some runouts. And I think that, that that's what that small lineup was able to do. I mean, who would have thought Will Bowser playing the five and Logan Neal playing the four and Tannis, Crombie, and Overway. I mean, that's a, nobody bigger than 6'5". And, and what, a, what, a great, what a great tribute to those kids because they rebounded hard out of it, too. All right, and you guys have got yourself an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. Yeah. What are your expectations? That's all. I, you know what? I don't even have a clue who we're going to play. And quite frankly, I don't care. We, we're, we're, we're serious, though, about not being a one-and-done team in the NCAA tournament. We're focused on, on, on going there, knowing our opponent, executing our game plan, and uh, we've said all year long that every game we play is a championship game. This was no different. It was a championship game for real, but we had played 26 of them already. Good luck and congratulations. Thank you.